Cubs haven't won a playoff game since 2003. This was supposed to be a blackout game. We're seeing more and more blue as we go. Here he is, tied for the league lead with four complete games and out away. And there's another strike. This is Billy. Cubs only won one postseason series in the previous 106 years. And that was in 2003. And on this October 7th night, 10-7, haven't won a World Series in 107 years. One, two, did he check his swing? Yes, he did. So says Hunter Wendelstead, the first base on Breyer. Derek Cole just couldn't match zeros early in the game. Only one time this year did he give up two home runs and a start, and he did it tonight. Little check swing for the first time in 12 years. The Chicago Cubs have a postseason victory. They win the wild card game, flanking the Pirates 4-0. And if DraftKings in Chicago, Illinois, there is Ridley. That's celebration. Congratulations, Chicago! Chances just could not bring a runner across. Yeah, he became human there for a minute. He gave up uh, a couple of hard-hit balls, had a chance to score, immediately the order up at that time, and then they just turned two double plays to get him out of the mess. And Joe Madden, when he was hired, they asked him, what did he see in this young club for next season? He said, I think this could be a 90-win team. Well, he was right. There's no way he thought it was going to be a 97-win team. A 97 win team that now goes on to meet another team they played 19 times this year. In that, that is just such a tough division head to head with the Cardinals and the Pirates and the Cubs, and now they get the Cardinals in the National League Division Series. And you raise the W flag as they do at Wrigley, and they raise it here at PNC Park. Either raise the Jolly Roger or Go Cubs Go. And Jake Garrietta made sure it was Go Cubs Go. Twenty-two game winner. Possibly the Cyan Award winner in the National League. Gets the ball in the wild card game and squeezes the life out of it. In the season where you talked about Chris Bryant from the beginning of spring training till he was brought up to the major leagues, it's Carl Schwarber, the rookie who has the huge game and the two-run home run that really put Arietta and the Cubs out comfortably. Chris Bryant was a glove. Yeah, there you go. You can't always make the contribution, get the big home run. But uh, Schwarber's home run. Right on time, Fowler had a really nice. The first two guys that came in without much numbers against Garrett Cole actually put up the numbers and gave Arianna the lead. Oh, 
Shorber had no home runs against right-handed pitching his last 52 at bats. And in the wild card game, he changes all of that. It's one of those things they do in the clubhouse. They gotta put the hands on the helmet. Kind of a ritual of moving up the helmet now. for Jake Arrieta, he's with Matt Weiner. Thank you, EJ. The National League pitcher for August and September turned out a pretty good in October as well. A shutout in your first postseason start. I'm exhausted. I haven't felt this way all year. Um, this atmosphere, the energy, it was unbelievable. Um, tried to use it to the best of my ability, um, but they were loud. They were really loud. Um, exactly what I expected. We, we came out, we fought early, got one on the board in the first, then we kind of settled in. We got a couple more, uh, a couple innings later, and then from there it was just, you know, pound the zone and try and get as many outs as quick as possible. 11 strikeouts, you were dominant early in the game, and you benefited from a couple double plays in the sixth and the seventh. What was going on in that stretch that got you through it? Well, just to, uh, even if I fell behind, just to keep the ball down, uh, try and force contact, some on the ground in the infield that we could handle for a double play. Uh, I was fortunate to get two big ones, uh, to get out of a couple jams. Um, but, you know, other than that, the offense was great. We came out, we fought against Garrett. Uh, he's got tremendous stuff. He's a competitor. Um, those guys are an amazing team. You know, they 98 wins. You know, the scenario, the situation as it was, one game, do or die, uh, one of us had to go. You know, so that, that, that's how it ended. But um, just a tremendous night. You know, it was outstanding. Outstanding. Not very often we see dugouts clear in a postseason game. What happened with the pitch from Watson? What did you say? And what happened in that scrum? Well, um, you know, I hit two guys. Um, I'm intentional. I'm, I'm never trying to hurt or hit anybody. Balls were slick tonight. Um, just, just lost, uh, lost it a couple times. You know, kind of ran away from me. Um, you know, I expected that. You know, they're gonna, they're gonna, um, you know, take care of their own guys. Um, it's understandable. Um, everything after that was fine. First time this club has advanced in the postseason since 2003 and a nine-game postseason losing streak along the way. And you know the history. Do you have a sense of what this means back in Chicago? Uh, it's tremendous for the city. Um, it's been a while. Uh, Chicago's been waiting for this, but it's only step one. You know, we've uh, we've had an incredible season. This is game, game one of the postseason for us. We'll carry this as momentum into St. Louis and and expect a really good series. How about the top of your lineup, Fowler and Schwarber? Incredible. I mean, Dexter today, what do you have, three three hits, three or four hits. Um, led off the game with a knock, scored in the first. Huge home run just to kind of take some of the wind out of these guys' sails in, in this park because um, we needed that. We needed somehow to take some energy out of this crowd, and we are able to do that. We'll see you in St. Louis. Congratulations. All right, buddy. Thank you. AJ, back up to you. All right, thank you very much. Matt, complete game for Jake Arrieta. And on a blackout night here in Pittsburgh, you look behind that first base dugout, and all you see, blue and white, of the Chicago Cubs as they celebrate the wild card victory over the Pittsburgh Pirates by a score of 4 to nothing. We'll be back to wrap things up here from PNC Park. Right